Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we'll be going through PubSub pattern, which is uh, pub publisher subscriber pattern. It's a very important pattern, and I'm assuming you are aware about observe pattern, or at least might have checked out my previous video about it. But just to be on the same page, what happens with observe pattern is like we have one subject and we have subscribers. So what happens is like if there is any state changes, the subs uh, it will notify uh, if there is any state change on the uh, subject side it will notify its subscribers of those changes okay but what happens is like in this pattern there is a light, uh, tight coupling involved here so what pubsub pattern does instead is like it has a broker involved in the middle of publisher and subscriber so what happens is like if, if um, the, and there is only topics the broker registers uh, subscribers for each topic okay and the publisher what it does is basically publishes events or uh, publishes data to those specific topics or you can say events and the subscribers which are listening to those events only those get notified in that way we can create multiple sub publishers and multiple subscribers the broker becomes the middleman here for uh, facilitating the communication okay it will become more clear while we implement the code okay let's start uh, i made a module type and let me come here I'll be taking the broker here and by that I'm going to be doing a very simplified impl implementation it you can tweak it however you might feel it based on your needs okay and I need to just have the publish it's going to take an event and whatever data it, it would like to publish to that specific topic or you can say event or channel whatever okay and I'll say this dot broker dot publish okay now let me create a broker I'll create a subscribers object each object will have a key of the event or you can say topic or you can say channel and it will have all the subscribers as the value okay so subscribe will have an event as well as a function in our case which can be again subscribers I am just keeping it simple here so what we will do is like first we will check whether the subscribers has something or not with this event name if it has then what I'll do is like I'll just take it and destructure it and we, if we don't have anything get registered we'll just create an empty not empty array we'll just create an array with the with this function call with this callback function okay similarly for unsubscribe I'll just do event fn. I'll just check whether is there is there is there something on first of all with this event name. If it is, then I'll just filter it out. This dot subscribe dot filter. subscriber is not equal to fm and I need a publish also publish is gonna be called for the publisher publish event comma data then I'll just do subscribers event dot for each for each subscriber and since it's just a fun our subscribers will just be functions I'm just gonna invoke them using the data it's just a simple simple implementation okay and this is it I guess let me come and use it index .js. 
publisher broker and let me create some subscribers function subscriber one data console dot log data okay I get a mistake here it should be data okay and what I can do is now I can read right let publisher equal to new publisher okay first I need to register broker also let broker equal to new broker then what I can do is like I can subscribe all these two functions on to a specific event which will be just event one now what I can do is publisher can publish some data on this event And what I can do, one more thing is let, let me show the unsubscribe also. So I have to just do event one comma subscriber one. Let me again publish something here. Subscriber one removed. That's it. Mm, I am using all the functions. Let's see how what is the output. CD of what? Okay, I think I missed out. Oh, sorry. Should be in brokers. This the subscribers event dot filter. As you can see, we are getting the output. First is the subscriber one. We are getting it new data, new data. Subscriber one, subscriber two, subscriber one, subscriber two. Then we have removed the subscriber one from the broker for this specific event one channel, like is a topic or event you can say itself. And then we are again publishing on the same topic and since subscriber 1 has been removed, uh, it's just going to only call subscriber 2. Yeah, that was it. I guess it uh, it's a very powerful pattern. I've just given a simplified uh, example. You can say implementation. You can tweak it however you feel like it. Okay, and I think that's it for this video. Okay, thanks and bye.